what it's like traveling with two kids from LA to New York. Luckily, one of them is pretty self-sufficient, but for Poppy, I still have to change her diapers regularly. I found it's easier if I pack one diaper, her diaper ash cream, and her wipes in a little bag inside her diaper bag, so that way when I have to change her, I just grab that little bag out and take her. It makes it quicker and I don't have to lug my whole diaper bag inside. After we board the plane, I always wipe it down with any common areas to touch, any of the buttons, the seatbelt, and the screens. And with my husband, it's a lot more helpful when he's here with me. I've never traveled on a flight with her by myself. Jaden is a few rows up, but she was going to sleep right away. So we're on our own back here. We're already low on sleep for the past few days, but we know that we're not going to be sleeping at all this entire flight. I tried to pack as many toys that I could that were easy to travel with. This one is something she got for Christmas and she loved it the day of, so I had to bring it. And her Spider-Man, she is obsessed with this. She also got it for Christmas. This kept her busy for about 45 minutes. She kept dropping the pieces and I had to find them for her but it was an activity we were able to do together. So kids under two aren't recommended to have any screen time unless it's a FaceTime call, and which is why the only show that we let Poppy watch